Yeah, if you've got a 9.9 .9, uh, Yamaha on your catamaran and it's an older model, um, then you've probably got manual tilt. But all the new models have got hydraulic tilt. And what happens is that you'll be aware that the, um, the, the hydraulic tilt on it hangs down a long way and it becomes a problem. It gets very close to the water. Water gets splashed all over the motor and uh, it's not satisfactory. So what I'm planning to do here is uh, modify the, um, the tilt on it so that the tilt is inboard inside the um, engine bay. What I've done, I've made a mock-up of an engine bay that's on my boat and uh, I'm going to um, show you what I've done. First of all, we take the old trim and tilt out. I've already removed all the bits to make it simple. There it is. I'll put it over here. Then I've removed the tilt tube or the steering tube. There it is, we don't want that anymore. What I've done is I've made up some aluminium brackets. Um, they're gonna go through onto the tilt pin, which is here, and then onto the hydraulic ram, which is here. So I'm going to assemble them now. One goes in there. through there I'll put the pin in down below here get the pin in now I'll look up the ram put a bolt through there I've pulled them out of the bits on this on this job to make it easier for me to work on it. So that's it there. That's in position. I'll get a bit of power. Hook the power on. Okay. Hopefully all that'll be good. I can, um, can, I can cut, I can cut through here, cut that off through there, and get rid of all that, so it's not hanging down in the water. Should be great. I've replaced the steering tube with an aluminium solid aluminium bar, which we don't need, and that goes through there. There'll be a nut on a, a nut and washer on each end of that, so. Um, and that'll be, that'll be all, keep it all in place. Yeah, to make all this possible, we've got to uh, modify the transom a little bit. And that'll mean cutting a piece out of the transom here uh, to allow for the brackets to go through. And here I've just cut the uh, transom brackets off on the bandsaw. I've cut the pods off, it's all looking good, and now we can tilt the motor down. Yeah, fantastic. Okay, up again. You can see where I've cut them off here. 
That's all nice. Yeah, I like that. And no more big pods sticking down. Very, very good. Hey, this water's cold. This is the extended pod that I fitted years ago to prevent uh, water from splashing all over the motor.